My name is Nishchai. I'm a technology enthusiast and working as a technology evangelist. I've been working in the field of education and e-learning for quite some time now and promoting the use and benefits of technological tools, apps and techniques in education. Whenever I meet educators and students, they often ask me questions about tools and apps that can be helpful to them in their day-to-day -day learning. So in this channel, I will try to answer some of these questions beginning today. So let's get started. So if you see over here, I have an equation already which I have uh, written on my screen using touch based input. So if I need to solve this equation, what I need to do is I, I need to use OneNote app and this app is easily available on Windows Store. If you see over here, it's a free app that can be downloaded from Microsoft uh, Windows Store and it can be installed on your PC, laptop or desktop. So once you install it, you can uh, use this to uh, write your algebraic equation and then solve it. Now how to do it I'll tell you. What you need to do is now once you have written the equation you need to click on the lasso tool over here and now you need to uh, select the equation. Once the equation has been selected click on math button and it will take time to generate the equation. Once it's done you can see the equation over here. Just in case if there are any errors click on fix it. Select the part of the equation which needs to be fixed and uh, select the right option from the menu and there you go. Click on done and then select an action for the value of x and then you have the result for the algebraic expression. You can also click on show steps and the steps will be shown for that particular equation how it has been solved. That's it. Done. Thanks for watching the video. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe if you have liked the video so that more can keep coming to you. Also do not forget to register for the webinar at www.aka.ms slash nishwebinar. In the webinar I provide a lot of details which can be helpful to the educators and the students in day to day learning. So thank you. Thank you so much.